Several of the Magitech data loggers that support triggers offer two different modes to choose from, window mode and two-point mode. Window mode is generally the first choice for most applications. With this mode, a user can either set a high or low trigger, or both, and if either threshold is breached, the data logger will begin recording. The number of readings the device writes to memory once triggered will be determined by this bottom section here. With the fill memory on first trigger tick box checked, once a reading goes beyond a threshold, the logger will continue recording until manually stopped or the memory is exhausted. Alternatively, users can untick this checkbox and type in the preferred number of readings that they'd like to be captured before the logging process automatically pauses once again. For example, if the trigger sample count is set to 30 samples, and there is a two-second reading interval, once a threshold is breached, the device would record for a total of one minute. Once this minute has concluded, if the following reading is still beyond the set threshold, the device would record for another 30 samples. If the readings are no longer beyond the set threshold, the device would be in standby, waiting on the next breach to trigger once more. Now for the two-point trigger mode. Instead of recording for a set number of samples, the device will trigger at the start set point threshold and pause the recording process at the stop set point threshold. In this example, we'll set the high start set point to 100 degrees Celsius and have the device stop recording at 80 degrees. With these settings applied, if the device recorded a reading beyond 100 degrees, the logger would be triggered to start the recording process at the user-defined reading interval. The device would continue recording for any amount of time or number of readings until a reading is captured below our stop set point of 80 degrees Celsius. Once the device is returned below the stop set point, the logger will await the next threshold breach of 100 degrees before triggering this process to begin again. Just like in window mode, two-point mode also allows for both a high and low trigger to be enabled. Once the trigger settings have been set up as desired, click the Apply button to save the settings to the device. For more information, call or visit us online at magtech.com.